All right, so behind me on this wall, uh, we worked on a data visualization using social media. We specifically picked Twitter. So the way it works is you send a tweet to any one of these nine hashtags, um, and then we're processing that tweet, well, we hope to process that tweet, right, uh, for its semantic analysis. And we're sending that off to IBM to do that work for us. So IBM Watson's helping out with that. We then get that back in the form of uh, some data. So whether you're angry, you're sad, joyful, or you're, you're afraid, those are the four major emotions we're looking at. So kind of see a different running clock on what's going on right now, current active tweets in, and then the current result. And that's dynamic, so it changes as everybody uses it, and it also changes based on when you decide to use it. So it's by time of day, emotion type, and hashtags. The kind of a three variable situation there. So in this wall, we have some work for um, some researchers at VMask uh, and what they've been working on. We wanted to showcase some of their work. So you've got some work with some virtual reality and some artists where we capture their movement. We have some work actually right now in real time. We're capturing inner arrivals. People are coming into the library, so we can do some crowd modeling of that if we wanted to later on. Um, and then in the upper right, we have some other VR work where we, from the Digital Senses Lab, where they put you in uh, a Western civilization back in Turkey called Çatalhöyük 5,000 years ago, so we could recreate those environments. Um, some work from cybersecurity and some other collaborative aspects from some artists working on a virtual reality painting program. So we just wanted to showcase some of the work here that VMAS has been doing at the library.